What if I told you one of Britain's most advanced locomotives was also one of its rarest? Welcome aboard for a journey into the past, the story of the legendary British Rail Class 89. In 1986, British Rail and Brush Traction unveiled the Class 89, a sleek, powerful electric locomotive built to revolutionise high-speed rail travel on the East Coast mainline. With six traction motors and cutting-edge tech for its time, it was poised to be a game-changer. But only one was ever built, Unit 89001, lovingly nicknamed Avocet. It was a prototype, a glimpse of the future, and for a brief time, it shone brightly. Pulling premier intercity services like the Flying Scotsman, it turned heads and proved its worth. Yet the future moved faster than Avocet could fly. The arrival of the Class 91, with government backing and full fleet orders, left the Class 89 an elegant oddity. It was too advanced, too expensive, and ultimately too alone. By 1992, after just a few years in service, the Class 89 was withdrawn. It made a brief comeback in the early 2000s with GNER, hauling express services once again. But fate wasn't on its side. Today, 89001 survives at the Barrow Hill Roundhouse, under the care of the AC Locomotive Group. Volunteers are working to bring it back to full health, not as a commercial machine, but as a rolling piece of history. Was it a success? A failure? Maybe. It was something else entirely, a bold experiment that never got its sequel, yet still found a place in the hearts of rail fans across the UK. If you love this, look back at the British Rail Class 89, give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow train lovers, and hit that subscribe button for more stories from the rails. What do you think? Should the Class 89 have been mass-produced? Or was its legacy stronger because it was one of a kind? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and tell us which locomotive you'd like us to cover next. Thanks for riding with us. Until next time, stay on track.